this generation's Moulin Rouge, Hugh Jackman proves to not only be a great Hollywood actor, but an incredible Broadway showman. Written by Jenny Bix and Bill Condon, and directed by newcomer Michael Gracie, this is an extremely romanticized, fantastical, stylized telling of P.T. Barnum and the rise of his circus. I mean, obviously, it's a musical for crying out loud, but I say that because if you're going into this movie, viewing it through the lens of, oh, it's a biopic, and therefore it must be 100% accurate, then you will be extremely disappointed because this is not that. It's like the animated version of Anastasia. This is a whimsical interpretation of how P.T. Barnum rose to fame. It's a spectacle, and actually kind of meta in terms of the humbug of it all, but anyways... It's still a great musical with incredible choreography and truly energizing and vibrant pieces. I think the best numbers for me involved Zac Efron and Zendaya with this choreography with the ropes. There's another number between Zac Efron and Hugh Jackman in the bar. And my favorite was Keela Settles and This Is Me when she's openly defiant against P.T. Barnum. And this is something to expect when your film's composers are Ben Pasek and Justin Paul who pen La La Land's lyrics. But when the bass thunders through the speakers and the scenes build up, you know your music is doing something right. And at the end of the day, it's completely a rags to riches tale where Jackman's interpretation of Barnum is basically confronting a persistent dilemma, an internal tug of war to be accepted by high society and to shove what they consider lowly straight in their faces. The film is superficial, as in it's light and fun and with messages of acceptance and diversity, everything you'd want in family-friendly fare during the holidays. The turmoils that are experienced are kind of without like a tension-ridden undercurrent or like undertones that your typical critic would, would consider substantive, but you know, not every film needs to have that. Sometimes a wonderful production with excellent music and incredible singing, dancing, and acting is sufficient in satisfying one's need for escapism and enjoyment. So if you're open to musicals, a fun little tale, and able to set aside the need for historical accuracy, then you'll have a great time. It's visually stunning, incredible performances all around by the cast, and the music shines above all else. The story is the weakest part of this film, though. Nevertheless, I think most will have a great time. Dan, remember, please subscribe so that you're notified in your newsfeed when the next video is uploaded. Please remember to give this video a like and share it about. Help support this channel through Patreon and using any of the affiliate links in the description below. You people are awesome, as always. Thanks for watching.